In this section, we will introduce you to challenges and equity considerations in health economics in general terms. Conducting an economic evaluation is not easy. There are many challenges and questions that arise when designing models and gathering input data. Models will always be a simplified representation of real life. Some of the common challenges include questions like, how do we define and measure health? How do we define and measure costs? What perspective should we adopt? Is the societal or the payer perspective most appropriate? What quality of evidence is available? Have the best modeling and research practices been followed? Are the findings relevant to policy or decision making and the real world? How can equity be considered and reflected in the analysis? Reducing inequities is an important goal of many health systems. This image shows social values relevant to the work of the Ontario Health Technology Advisory Committee, or OTAC. As economic evaluation assumes the societal objective of maximizing population health, equity is explicitly accounted for in economic evaluation. Qualities gained are considered of equal value, whether they occur in young or old people, marginalized groups, etc. If reducing inequities, however, is an additional goal, this could be facilitated by a stratified analysis. Some groups advocate for different willingness to pay thresholds for specific priority groups, such as those for rare or terminal diseases. Increasing the thresholds for one group necessarily requires reducing the threshold for other groups. If such weights are to be applied, they would need to reflect actual societal preferences, and most research has concluded that there is limited appetite for prioritizing one group of patients over another. However, economic evaluation is only one component of the health technology assessment process, and other aspects such as equity are typically included in the deliberative frameworks used by HTA bodies. To summarize, reducing inequities is an important goal of many health systems. Economic evaluation models simplify complex real-life problems, yet are still useful for informing decision-making. There are many methodological challenges to economic evaluation. Methods are evolving, and following up-to-date guidelines is always advised. Economic evaluations value qualities equally, regardless of to whom they accrue. While health technology assessment considers equity implications of the reimbursement recommendation, amongst many other implications. This concludes section one of our three section introduction to health economics for public health practitioners module. To learn more about health economics, please see the optional further reading and resources list or proceed to section two of this module to apply your knowledge in a case scenario.